Local businesses are coming together to help serve dinner to thousands of Jackson families. 12 News' Gary Burton reports. COVID-19 has pushed JPS schools back all the way until April and maybe even longer. For many young people, that means missing a meal they look forward to. Volunteers are trying to fill that void at Bates and Galloway Elementary and Cardoza and Chastain Middle School. They passed out hundreds of meals, but safety came first. We have the health questionnaire from the Centers for Disease Control that asks a series of questions. We also uh, are providing personal protective equipment, the gloves, the aprons, and the masks that volunteers must wear. Um, if they answer yes, to any of the questions, we send them home. We've actually had to do that at one of our sites today, two of the volunteers that traveled out of town, so we sent them home. Eaton Aerospace, the Systems Companies team, the Center for Entrepreneurship and more have contributed over $14,000 towards these meals. Faulkner says that these dinners are for everyone in Jackson and not just for JPS families, and that she hopes to continue this for as long as possible. We realize that even when school is back in session and folks go back to work, that it will take a while for people to recover financially. Today, chicken tetrazzini with green beans, and tomorrow, baked chicken with oven roasted potatoes. Good hearty meals that cost less than $5 to make. The child nutrition staff prepares these meals and we are being able to provide hot meals for about $4.63. If someone has $5,000 or $15,000 or $100,000, whatever it is, we will use it to feed scholars and families during this pandemic. Gary Burton reporting. Be sure to go to our website at WJTV.com for the information you need to donate. That's just one of several efforts going on to help with the need in Jackson.